Station Mobile Nations. We're in Kitchener Waterloo at Alnick Labs with Chris, right? Yep, Chris. Chris, uh, who's working on the Mile Armband. That's right. It's this thing right here, right? This thing right here. What is it? So, um, well, first of all, this is the Mile Armband, the, the final production unit that is going to be shipped to consumers in September. Um, we have our Mile Developer Kits, which is the same hardware that's going to be shipped next month, which is extremely exciting. Um, it's the upgraded from this uh, version of the, of the device. This is the alpha version. Um, so the way it works, is it actually combines two really powerful technologies, one of which is, has been around for years. Um, so along, along the armband itself, you actually have eight EMG sensors. So EMG, electromyography, that technology has been around for, for many years now. You would see them in the traditional operating room setting. You have those little electrodes on, the, on a person's chest. It's, it's looking for your heart activity. Um, well, basically, what those sensors do is they, they monitor the small electrical signals that are on the surface of your skin that are produced when you activate your muscles. Uh, so by having these sensors along the surface of your forearm, we can actually have visibility of your forearm muscles. Um, so by understanding what you're doing with your forearm muscles, we can essentially see what you're doing with your hands, which is a very cool new piece of technology. We've never really had that before. Um, so we paired that technology with an IMU, which is an inertial measuring unit. Um, it basically gives you visibility of the motion and the orientation of the device. So by pairing, by using that sensor, we understand what you're doing with your form. So as you move it, um, the myo band understands that. You combine that with the EMG sensors along the eight channels, and now you understand what you're doing with your hands as, hands as well. Pair those two together, and you have gesture control. Interesting. So <laughs> in terms of like knowing what your hand can do, uh, uh, we've seen through the demos that there's a lot of fist clenching, but like, is there like single finger recognition, that kind of thing? Um, at, at this stage, we, we won't have that detection. Um, we will offer various poses that, that will be available in our SDK for developers to work with. Um, however, as we continue to refine the technology, um, we, we start to improve machine learning algorithms which are necessary to understand the subtleties between the various movements and, and the individual fingers. So as we move forward, we're, we're definitely hoping to have that, that level of visibility in the, the individual finger. So I'm getting the impression this is still pretty early stages for you guys. We're still getting the, uh, the developer kits out. Are you getting a lot of early interest so far? Uh, we're getting a ton of interest, yeah. yeah. And, and yes, we are still in the early stages. Um, we had our pre-orders. Uh, we launched our pre-orders just over a year ago. And we had just a flood of pre-orders. Um, and since then, we've actually continued to, to build up on those pre-orders, and we're finally getting there where we're, where we're actually going to ship and fulfill these orders. Um, so as you can imagine, we have a, a wide community that's extremely eager to, to get their hands on these devices. Um, and we're also just as eager to give it to them, just to see what they can do with it. I'm sure. So let's say folks are really interested in this, where do they get one, how do they do it? Um, the best way to get it right now is actually through our website, Bowman.com. Um, we have a pre-order link right on the front page. Um, from there, you can pre-order a Mile Developer Kit, which is the developer version of this product. It, it is this hardware right here, which is the final hardware. However, it doesn't have the consumer software that, that is that is needed to have that, that initial unboxing experience. Um, those are going out to developers interested in building out applications that works in the hardware. The consumer version, um, you can also pre-order on our webpage. Um, it comes in, in black as well as white. And those will be shipping in September. And those will have more of a, a complete out-of-box experience. You'll be able to go use the mile, go onto our, our website, and, and see exactly what it is that you can do with it. There should be a lot of content there for consumers. Yeah, yeah. We're looking at both PC and mobile. Like, What, what, what kind of uh, apps are we looking at that are working with this? Yeah, for sure. It, it's actually a combination of of a bunch of various platforms. So PC is a good one. You can imagine controlling your PowerPoint presentation. Um, if you have games on your PC, you can control them using the armband. Um, basically, any any software that you have, you can basically map out the gestures to keyboard commands or that sort of thing and have full control of that. Um, so people like to play music off their, their, their PCs, for example, on iTunes or whatever, you would have control of those. Um, if you expand into the mobile space, um, this is where it really gets exciting because now you can kind of take out or take this technology on the go with you. Um, for example, if you if you have a Parrot AR drone, you can fly that with the Mylar out of the park or whatever. Um, if you have 
um, technologies in a connected home, for example, the Hue light bulb or the Sonos stereo system. Um, you have control of that, and it, and it, it all goes through your mobile device. Um, so when we when we launch, we'll have support for Mac and Windows in the PC world, and Android and iOS. Um, and for game developers out there, we're also releasing a Unity package for Windows and, and Mac. Nice, nice. Well, looking forward to it. It looks really cool. Yeah, that's very really exciting. Well, guys, that's uh, Mile at uh, Thalmac Labs. So, uh, Chris, uh, it's coming out in September for 150 bucks, right? 150 dollars. That's correct. Awesome.